Guys, this is a like, special edition, if you will, a review. Uh, <laughs> this is the Sky High review, because I am I. And uh, as you guys have seen the drunk review on it, so this is another thing. And I like it. We're going to get into it right now, man. Oh, it's a good day. It is. I don't know why I got the Hawaiian shirt on. I just kind of felt like lounging, you know? Been in like a tropical mood. <clears throat> got me some Tropicana to drink. Everything. It's great. It's great. Okay, so. I did want to do. I did want to show you guys shoot two. <laughs> two products. Uh, by Palm King Pomades. One of them is the Butterbeer one special edition limited if you will um, <clears throat> little butter beer batch of pomade and uh, not all the labels are the same I believe we have two yes we do we have two and the labels are like it's the same theme but the words are in, not in the same spots it's not the same label as far as the scent goes though it looks it smells really good it smells like the butter beer it does you know what? And it feels heavy too. That's great. I thought it was gonna be a medium. I just, just right now. That's great. But that one's magical. Give me, you know, powers and shit. But this one is the one that won the cake for me. The uh, OG Green Gamma Grease. Well, the OG label. And they changed that because you know, just in case there might be problems. You know what I mean? Now the pomade is green, right? It's thick as fuck. It's oil based. It's great. It smells like a, I think it's Asian sandalwood. It's cool. It's real cool. Uh, I really like the scent, and I really like how this product performs. It gives me crazy height. You guys have seen the pictures on EP. It's there, and you know what? If the ingredients are beeswax, lanolin, coconut oil, petroleum, tea tree oil, sandalwood scent, and color. So there you go. It's like tea tree and sandalwood. <clears throat> Those are the ingredients. It's kind of surprising because lanolin is very thick. And so sometimes it'll, you know, weigh your hair down. If you have like really thick, wavy hair like me, you have to put a lot of product. And it will weigh the hair down the product itself will weigh your hair down but this has great height for that <clears throat> it smells good man so let's get this show on the road I wanna <clears throat> I wanna see if I can fit in two videos to be honest with you guys oh by the way the scooping is it's a little rough but it's not like back of your fingernail rough you know what I mean it's doable, it's scoopable. It's a little thick, okay, okay, but it's scoopable. All right, so the breakdown is obviously the same how it's gonna be for any really thick oil-based pomade. <clears throat> uh, you gotta melt it down. You know what I'm saying, and for me, it's gonna be tough putting this stuff in my hair because of all the layers I am going to have to go through. <clears throat> Cause you can't just go from the top to the bottom real quick. You gotta be able to. Well, you know what I mean, man. Ugh. You gotta get everything. It's real hard to do that with thick hair because because you can't get through it. You know what I'm saying? There's levels to this shit. So it's one scoop, two scoops. I didn't want to use it though for the sheer fact that I'm almost done with it like for real I know it doesn't look like it but after this I'm almost done with it I used it oh I used it every day almost every day um for Viva Viva Las Vegas that was cool that was great man it was awesome <clears throat> I uh actually waited cause I wanted to you know kinda I was kind of like a peacock, you know, throwing my feathers up there, kind of like a little dance, you know, <laughs> to the other dudes, like, you know, it's, it's my place. So, I, like, you know, I, we were waiting in line to get these Dita Von Tees tickets, and uh, 
<clears throat> was a long line. There was a pre-sale line or something like that. <clears throat> oh yeah, you had to wait in the morning so that you could go watch her at night. That's what it was. This line was so long, and now you know, we had to get out the door to go get in that line, so I didn't do my hair. I was like, you know what, I'll just bring the grease, bring a shop rag, you know, do this right. And uh, I got there, I'm just waiting in line, yeah, and I wanted to wait a little bit, you know, make sure I got a better view for, you know, for everybody watching. And then uh, eventually we turned a corner, and it was this big old hallway that wrapped all the way down, all the way around. And I was like, you know what, now, now I'll do my hair, you know, because I want to show off <laughs> my skills, boy, my skills. A lot of people looking, you know, even uh, the day before, I was bowling with my girl, Viva, and the guy who was coming up and he was asking about my hair, he was asking what I put in it, so I told him, you know. Like people watch and it's just it's a good feeling. It's cool for me. It's like my gift to you. <laughs> do you do you get what I mean? People get are entertained, I'm entertained, I get to sculpt with it. This shit is art. That is what I mean. This shit right here is art. <clears throat> oh, guys, I also have some new tools right here. You know, I didn't have nothing last video, and I couldn't do it yesterday because I didn't have no no time, but I got the combs. I got two combs. Let's check these out real quick. So I got another hatchet comb is what I'm calling it because it looks like a hatchet. <sighs> so this one's good for just the being able to dig through all that thick wavy hair. Oosh. Now that is tugging cool. You, you feel it? Oh, good lord. That's my thick ass hair though. Mm. That's fucking crazy. And I got another little comb right here. Just feeling everything, you know. Little strange thing, and I bought these at Sally's because uh, I was like, you know, oh, professional beauty store or something like that. Let's see what they got. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Apparently, that's all I got. <laughs> that works for me. I mean, they have the little tiny frick combs, the little thin combs that some people use. That gets through like half a layer of hair. They don't reach all the way to the back. So pretty much, we're just covering like a shell of this shitty hair on the inside, you know, because I'm not combing that. Okay, onward. All right, so, you guys know how it goes. The first coating is never going to be as good as the build-up. You know, and, like, same here. The first uh, few scoops ain't going to be done yet. You got to shake the head and figure out where all the dry spots are. Add some grease in there. Maybe I should, nah, 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 nah. Okay, I was gonna say, maybe I should dig into the uh, little, little Patronus butter beer there, mix it up. Yeah, we'll do that, we'll do that real quick. Do one little small, you know what I mean? Throw it all in the hair. It's the same brewer, it don't matter, baby. Damn, baby. What is you doing? You all over the place. Sorry, that's internet stuff. <laughs> Sticks in your head, you know? <clears throat> Peter, Piper, Peter, Peter. Okay. And this is a butter beer. So it's like a butterscotch sandalwood. It's a strange mix. Or is it a good mix? I scooped out 
Man, it's like it's like putting caramel in my hair. Man, that's delicious. I don't care who you are, that's delicious. <laughs> okay, boom. Review some of these dry spots. Rich chill. You know what I mean? Look at that, look at that. If that don't prove it right there, come on, boy. I really hope I don't look back on this when I'm sober and be like, oh god, what am I doing? You know? <clears throat> this is only recording the video and it already feels like it's out there. It's a trip. <clears throat> Means my stuff works. <clears throat> what this will do, it will be able to do like a pump. I'm gonna do a high pump a wedge just to show you guys like what this shit is capable of. Oh, oh wait, a little bit left over, put in the, in the goatee, you know it's like in the thing. Yeah I mean There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. One second. In the land of rock and roll. Shop rack, clean out the grease. <clears throat> It'll be a lot easier to do now that we have the right size comb, you know what I'm saying? Just because it reaches all the way back in the hair. <clears throat> and any pro knows you need that, and I'm about to show you exactly why in one fucking go, baby. fix you get a little bit of that little bit openness because it's all volumized but look at that shit man what is you doing baby you all over the place mmm oh, see look at that little straggler hair look at that how oh, that took way more time putting it in the hair than I did grooming my goddamn hair okay this shit is multi-purpose means I can comb it, comb it down slick it down and come at it fuck a few minutes later and fucking do it. You know what I'm saying? Do it again and again and again. Look at this. Boy. Your product needs to be able, I wanted to say this earlier, needs to be able for me to use to impress other people. If your product's not capable of doing this, how am I going to show other people what this good shit is. What's capable of that? Anybody could do a comb to the side, man. Anybody. Anybody could do a slick back. Comb to the side, a little volumized parting. Who can do this? Not everybody. <sighs> yeah, I'm, I'm just laughing at myself right now. <laughs> Not everybody, though. To stay on topic. You know, I can wear anything in my hair. If I can't work with it, I slick it back because, you know, that's what everything else can do. That's why I like heavies, super heavies. Best explanation I can do for you. <clears throat> Come out the goatee a little bit too. <clears throat> I really like Palm King products because it's, honestly, it's basic. It's to the point has just enough to be great and then you know that's why it's affordable that's the good thing to me it has my whole concept in mind you know a lot of people were saying um, or a few people not a lot like oh like it seemed ghetto because it's not like what in an amber jar in the fucking glass jar in a purple tin you know what I'm saying it's in the classic grease tins like is that so bad Come on, man. Don't be fooled by packaging, okay? Maybe it's not tied in a potato sack 
or some shit. You know what I mean? <laughs> Potato sack. You know, but this stuff is quality stuff, man. The scents are top notch. The red gamma smells like cherry cola. It takes my breath away, man. It takes my breath away. You know what I'm saying? And I have a tonic if my hair ever gets like suffocated enough and loses, you know, all the nourishment. Like the tonic is just boop, boop, boop. And it does exactly what the other pomades do, you know? Only this stuff lasts longer because, you know, it's not orthodox or water based or nothing like that. <clears throat> I don't know. I just don't know. It's good stuff, though. I didn't know how much I had. Um, I was uh, just trying to think, like, why don't I have pumpkin products? Like, I don't have the one with the line on it, I don't have the, uh, the grippy. You know, but I have a lot of other things. But then I realized that he does like other collabs and stuff for other people, like Lucky Franks. You know, he collabed with Modern Man TV. You know, he's got his, um, he has like an Asbury Park one. You know, he's got a bunch of different stuff. So I have a lot of his collabs, but nothing like the OG, the Gammas. You know, I had none of that. And then, you know, got my hands on some. Via his help. Blessed. I think you guys should try it out. It's affordable. You know what I'm saying? Smells great. Works great. You know? They have the lights and the mediums too. I have the KO. It smells like great. It's like a blackberry type of feel. It's delicious. <clears throat> you know, you can use it. It's got everything, man. And it's the same quality, you know? <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Uh, I did. I am. I'm going to keep doing it. I did want to come out with a second video, but I'm not sure if I have time. Let me check. 312. I mean, I kind of have time. I kind of have time. I could probably do a second video. This is good. Is this going to be a, uh, you know, like a welcome to the world of Palme type of video, you know, I think you guys would enjoy that, I, I would enjoy that, um, but since this is oil based, I have some other tins of some hidden level, you know, or just, you know, like on the black market, my, you know, my own mysteries I gotta get rid of first, so that's, I'm not doing any reviews until after that washes out, and there's like half a tin, pretty much. So I go through that first, and then I gotta wash that out, and then I'll have dry hair to do another review. Maybe touch this little stripe up. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Ooh, yeah, we wasting some time here. You guys have a good uh, Cinco de Mayo weekend. Um, we gonna be doing things in the future, man. <laughs>